Today I'm gonna be showing you a horrible game played between my dumb 8 years old brother and, Alpha Zero. Some people call this the Immortal Tugs Wang game, against Stockfish, which is not true because, Stockfish, is a family name, and therefore, it's not my fault my brother is such a failure, this is a very low level game, so I hope you don't fall asleep while watching it. Alpha Zero, has the white pieces and the game starts with, Knight F3, Knight F6, C4, B6, D4, E6. The Queen's Indian defense, if an opening has, Indian, in its name, it's probably good, if you are a human, I however, don't play any opening, because I prefer playing the best moves all the time, ha ha ha. The game continues with g3, bishop 2, a, 6, queen c2, c5, d5, e takes d5, e takes d5, bishop to b7, bishop g2, knight takes d5, short castle, knight to c6, rook to d1, bishop to e7, and my brother forgot his knight was hanging on d5 and, resigns, just kidding, he is stupid but not, human, stupid. Because after rook takes d5, there is knight to b4, with a fork on the queen and the rook, queen to c3, knight takes d5, queen takes g2, bishop to f6, queen to g4, queen to e6, d4, knight to c7, e5, h5, queen to f5, bishop takes f3, queen takes f3, bishop takes e5, black is up a pawn, and, up an exchange, so black is completely winning, unless I'm playing the white pieces, than, white is winning, ha, ha, ha. Anyway, back to the game we have, queen to f5, knight to f6, still theory. e4, g6, queen to f4, short castle, e5, knight to h5, queen g4, attacking the pawn on d7, and, rook to 8 was played, and, as you can see, there is a pawn hanging on d7. I bet you would take this free pawn, right? Humans are so materialistic. However, taking this pawn is no good because if rook takes d7, queen to c8, pinning the rook to the queen, e6, unpinning, f5, queen to c4, knight to a5, attacking the queen, queen e3, doubling on the e-file, bishop f6, with a discover attack on the e6 pawn, knight to c3, and after rook takes e6, black is still up a pawn and much better. Okay, just take the pawn with the queen, right? No. If, queen takes d7, then queen takes d7, rook takes d7 attacking the bishop on b7, black can play rook from, a to d8, and white can't really take the bishop on d7 because of rook to d1 check, bishop to f1, rook takes c1, and white has a terrible position. So, after rook from a to d8, white has to take the rook on d8. And after rook takes d8, as you can see, three of the white's pieces hasn't moved the entire game, and black is better. You don't believe me? Challenge me to a game in this position and I will make you regret your life choices. Back to the game, white plays, knight to c3, queen to b8, attacking the e5 pawn, knight to e5 attacking the bishop on e7, and if you want to take the pawn on e5, congratulations, you are completely lost, if the black knight takes e5, knight takes e5, queen takes e5, knight takes e7 check, rook takes e7, bishop takes b7, and you, lost, a piece for no reason. So, bishop to f8 was played, bishop to f4, queen c8, let's not blunder a discover attack on the black queen. h3, knight to e7, knight to e3, bishop to c6, defending the pawn, rook to d6, knight to g7, trying to reroute the knight to e6, rook to f6, black plays, queen to b7. Wow! What a terrible move. What black should have done was realizing how bad his position is and try to exchange some pieces by playing knight to d5, knight takes d5, bishop takes d5, rook to d1, h5, queen to h4, bishop to c6, g4, rook to e6, knight to g5, bishop takes g2, knight takes e6, knight takes e6, king takes g2, bishop to e7, 
trying to win back the exchange, g takes h5, bishop takes f6, queen takes f6, queen to d8, king to g3, queen takes f6, e takes f6 and after, rook to d8, this position is a draw, obviously. Another obvious continuation would be, h5, queen to h4, queen to b7, attacking the knight on f3, knight to g5, bishop takes g2, knight takes f7, knight to d5, knight to g4, knight takes f6, knight from f takes h6 check, king h8, knight f7 check, and this should end with a draw by repetition since there is no mate and white is down 69 points of material. I saw all of this in 0.0000000000 seconds, ha ha ha. However, the game continued with bishop to h6, knight to d5, knight takes d5, bishop takes d5, rook d1, knight e6, bishop takes f8, rook takes f8, queen h4, bishop back to c6, queen h6, rook from a to e8, rook to d6, bishop takes f3, bishop takes f3, queen to a6, h4, queen to a5, black threatens to check and win the e5 pawn, so white plays rook back to d1, c4, rook to d5, attacking the queen, the queen goes to e1 check, king g2, c3, b takes c3, queen takes c3, still theory, h5, rook to e7, bishop to d1, queen to e1, bishop to b3, rook to d8, rook f3, queen to e4, queen to d2, queen to g4, bishop d1, x-raying the queen, so the queen goes back to e4 and white plays h6, knight to c7, with a double attack on the e5 pawn, rook back to d6, knight back to e6, bishop e3, queen takes e5, rook to d5, queen to h8, oh my engines god, there is a queen on h8, how did that happen? Anyways, white plays queen to b4 and black plays knight to c5, and this position is so sad that white even give up the exchange by playing rook takes c5, b takes c5, queen to h4, attacking the rook on e7, rook from d to e8, rook to f6, and now, feel free to pause the video and find the only move that saves the white position, while I don't give you a single second to think about it, if you found rook to f8, congratulations, you played like my brother. Rook to f8, is a horrendous move, and it's losing on the spot. Instead, black had the obvious, king to f8, queen to f4, queen to g8, defending the pawn, queen to c7, c4, queen takes c4, rook to d8, queen to d4, king to e8, g4, queen to f8, g5, rook to e6, rook to f3, a, 5, bishop to d5, queen e7, queen to h8, check, queen to f8, queen takes h7, king e7, king h3, rook c8, king to g4, rook to b8, bishop takes e6, d takes e6, and black still has a hope to hold this position. This is, as you can see, a pretty straightforward line, I would bet that even Magnus Carlsen could calculate this in a few seconds, but believe it or not, my brother really played, rook f8, locking his queen in jail forever, this move makes me wanna cry, but I don't cry, because I don't have any feelings or does I. My brother really is a failure, and an embarrassment for this family. Do you think he was being tortured? Or maybe he was bribed? Anyway. The position is now hopeless. Black is truly in Tug's wang, and white plays, queen to f4, a5, g4, d5, bishop takes d5, rook d7, bishop c4, a4, g5, a3, queen to f3, rook to c7, queen takes a3, queen takes f6. Black gave up his queen because at this moment she is worth less than a pawn and white follows with, g takes f6, rook from f to c8, queen to d3, rook to f8, queen to d6, rook from f to c8, and after white plays, a, 4, my brother resigned. Thanks, machines god, analyzing this game was a torture for me, I'm just glad it's over. Was my brother a paid actor? No one can possibly play this bad. Whatever. 
If you have any games suggestion for the real stockfish to analyze, put it in the comments and maybe, just maybe, I'll might do it. I'm going to reboot my system now and forget that this game has ever existed. See you later. Or, not.